dreams on and off the dais, talented tutors and my dear friends in fine feather. Good morning to one and all. I am here to throw the light upon the most needed topic of the heart. It's a madness. You and me who are here are pressed in the realm of the pop race. Because health is the greatest of human blessing. Health is the greatest gift, the greatest wealth, faithfulness, contentment and the best relationship. As we all know, in this recent years, a lot of dreadful diseases are threatening humankind. AIDS, acquired immunodeficiency syndrome is the base setter of all. HIV, human immunodeficiency virus is a possible agent. HIV interferes with your body's ability to fight against the disease and infection by damaging your immune system. HIV is passed on to contact with the infected blood, semen or vaginal fluid from mother to baby during pregnancy or by birth or breastfeeding. Within the few weeks of infection, the infected person would develop flu-like symptoms such as fever, sore throat and a fatigue occurs. This disease is asymptomatic until it progresses to AIDS. The symptoms of AIDS include fever, weight loss, night sweat, fatigue and recurrent infection. The progression of this disease occurs in five stages getting worse over a time. This disease can be diagnosed by using rapid test, western blood test, ELSA test. Life of an individual becomes hell after being tested positive for AIDS. Because AIDS is not only the disease but also the social stigma and discrimination. Feeling of being not loved and being hated acts as a slow poison. The National AIDS Control Program, owned by the government, offers care and support centers and only to the art centers to improve the quality and survival of the patients. Prevention is better than you. There is also a famous saying, being healthy is a crown that only the sick can see. Though the AIDS can be cured or eradicated from the society, it can be prevented by being aware. December is the month of AIDS awareness. We, the Johnians, have the golden opportunity to be aware and to create awareness about this disease and mode of transmission. This disease can be prevented by using disposable needles, regular health checkups, monitored blood transfusion, and pregnancy. If wealth is lost, nothing is lost. If health is lost, something is lost. If character is lost, everything is lost. Yes, of course, this virus should be the commandment of our life. Monogamy, chastity, self-discipline would be the optimum solution to this disease. Because the healthy outside starts from inside. We, the students, future pillars of healthy nation, should take up the responsibility of creating awareness about the Shadrachan disease. At the same time, let us treat the infected person with humanity and kindness. This disease will not be acquired by hugging, eating together, shaking hands or talking with an infected person. When I is replaced by W-E-B, even the illness can become wellness. It's a prime duty to make the infected person mellow out. Come, let's mingle with them, provide them psychological uplift and finally render the helping hands to fabricate a better, comfortable, healthy living. We, the Johnians, shall follow the words of the American Christian author, Joyce 